are just hours away from the Oregon Ducks debut game in the Big Ten Conference and the city is warning fans the area around Autzen Stadium is going to be packed with people and traffic. Thanks for joining us here this afternoon. I'm Albert James in for Matt and our top story here at 4 KEZI 9 News reporter Madison Yee shows us the big changes around the stadium that people need to know about. The Eugene Police Department expects a huge influx of traffic this weekend, but they're prepared with new flaggers that will route drivers towards the gateway area. Whether this is your first game day in Eugene or you're a seasoned veteran, Duck fans should be prepared for a busy weekend on the roads. I spoke with the Eugene Police Department about how they've been preparing for the weekend, and they say they've added new flagger positions on the road as they're testing out a new way to keep the flow of traffic steady. We've recently added some positions on Garden Way in particular uh, with flaggers in place to smooth egress from the stadium. Uh, it's going to push traffic out to the area of Gateway that can handle a lot more volume of traffic. So we're trying that out this, this football game in this season and we have pretty high hopes that it's going to rele relieve a lot of pressure. But the Eugene Police Department says the best way to avoid the congestion is to simply avoid the area. Alternate routes include the Washington Jefferson Bridge, Delta Highway, Cal Young Road, or Harlow Road. And if you're going to the game, take the bus. This will help ease up traffic for everyone. It's the first game day since traffic patterns on Martin Luther King Jr. Boulevard were changed. What drivers should expect on game day, coming up on KEZI 9 News at 5. Reporting in Eugene, Madison Eish, KEZI 9 News.